it's your girl jay and welcome back to my youtube channel now if this is your first time of stopping by you're most indefinitely welcome also if you're returning back to this channel thank you so much for sticking with this baby girl i do not take it for granted now if this is your first time of stopping stumbling on my channel hello again my name is jay and on this channel i put out content about beauty makeup youtube tips business tips perfume health tips and yeah i plan to do some vlogging later so if this sounds like something that you'll be interested in then you can consider subscribing to my channel i would appreciate that a lot anyways today's um in today's video we're going to be creating a look of course that's why we're here okay so we're going to be creating a look and it's a cut crease look i mean recently i have been in the cut crease mode <laughs> you know yeah i have just um I, I i've just been trying my hands around like different cut crease looks and all of that so in today's video we're going to be creating another cut crease look so yeah i did my brows off camera and yeah we're just going to get started into the high so um the first thing that you know how i do is to conceal my high lids and i'm using the ellie girl pro concealer in chestnut yeah i'm using that so i'm just going to apply some to my high lids and yeah we'll be good to go so here you go. oh shit too much i applied too much okay so i'm going to be taking a br brush right now and i'm going to be taking this not so flat brush something like this and I'm going to be blending. So I'm just blending. I'm going to blend here as well. Spread it. Make sure there are no ash lines and stuff. Okay, okay, okay. So next up, I'm going to be using, I'm sure you guys already know that I like this palette already. I'm going to be using the Beauty Glaze Gorgeous Me Eyeshadow Palette for this look as well. And yeah, we're just going to get started. Anyways, for the first shade, I'm going to be picking this um, color right here. I don't know if you can see, but I'll leave a picture on the screen so that you guys can see the um, color I'm picking. Okay, so I'm going to be picking like a burgundy color. It's not like burgundy. But you guys will see it sharp. So I'm picking that color and I just want to apply it to my crease area. So I'm applying it to my outer crease. And then I'm just spread, spreading it and blending it inwards. So you'd notice that we have the bulk of the product at my outer crease. So I'm taking more of that same product and I'm just tapping it at, the, at my outer crease area. I'm tapping it in my outer crease and I'm bringing it down so that it just goes like all the way to my highlights as well so and it's looking like i'm making an outer v so i'm just tapping that product in and i'm just um, blending it inward lightly i don't want it to be too pronounced you know i don't want it to be too pronounced so yeah so this is what we're looking like right now i think i like the feel of this so next up i'm going to be taking this burnt orange color i'm going to be taking burnt orange color tapping out the excess and then i just go a little above my crease and then i go in tap it out at the outer corner as well okay i'm blending it into the first shade of that i picked blending it in 
putting all the and then i'm going in to just blend it out or blend it in as it looks so i'm blending it in okay blend 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 oh, i like it okay so i'm just going to further blend because i don't want no harsh lines and stuff so i'm just going to further blend it Okay, so we can see that there are no ash lines and oil, but because I want to kind of create um, a very not so intense smoky look at my outer V, I'm going to be going in with this black shade. I'm going with the black shade and I'm just tapping off the excess and then as usual, I'll put it at my outer view and just put all almost all that product at my outer V and yeah I'm just blending with the light hand inwards and slightly to form like a V And I just want to blend inwards and I'm blending lightly okay now ah this is nice okay so for my outer V um yeah i i'm i'm looking at it like i mean it's smoky and all of that but i think i want it more dramatic than this so i'm going to pick more black and just tap it into my outer v and then i just blend it in okay so this is what our highs is looking like right now okay now the fun part of it it's time to cut out a crease anyways so i'm going to be using this my flat concealer brush this is what i actually use to define my brows but yeah i also use it to cut my crease as well so yeah i'm going to be using it for the purpose of today's video as well and i probably have to do some cleaning because i used it for my brows anyways to cut my crease i'm going to be using the benign um, benign clown white eyeshadow base and yeah that's what i'm going to be using to cut my crease so i'm just making sure that it's flat again and then i'm picking up some eyeshadow base and yeah now the trick about this is to get a uh, a perfect but I, yeah, I'll say a perfect cut crease what you should do or what I like to do let me just personalize this what I like to do is I'll apply the eyeshadow base on my lids just like I'm doing right now and then I open my eyes like all the way like I'm looking up okay so that way I know where to start cutting my crease from and that's where 
that eyeshadow base extended to so that's where we are going to be cutting our crease wrap so i'm just getting more product and yeah we're going to be doing that so i think here yeah, i have just what i want i have just what i want so next up is i'm going to be taking my flat brush this flat brush here and i'm going to be picking this very nice shimmery shade over here yeah that's what we're going to be using today 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 so i'm picking the shimmery shade and i'm just patting it on my cut crease you want to make sure that when you're applying your eyeshadow on your cut crease you are not going beyond um, where you've cut okay so just go slightly around it make sure that you're just applying it yeah the crease is cut imagine this would turn out i mean i just add this look in my head and it's turning out really nice okay so here's what we are looking like right now i blended the whole thing and i just still feel like they have ash lines and stuff so i'm still going to just go over it just a little bit just blending the whole thing okay this is much better yeah this is much better so yeah we're pretty much done with this high okay so yeah i'm just going to go ahead and um apply my eyeliner and for my eyeliner today i'm going to be using my usual highliner my dynamic liquid eyeliner pencil and i'm just going to be drawing i'm not drawing any dramatic look though because this um side of my hair is already smoky okay so i'm just going to nothing dramatic something within the usual line I'm going to be um, applying my lashes and yeah I've been liking this set of lashes for some time now so I've pretty much been using anyone in this set so today I'm going to be using this lash as well and like it's more dramatic i mean i want drama so we're going to be using this which one is okay we're going to be using this this one here, right here okay so we're going to be using this one okay guys so it's done and that's that so again this is what we're looking like and I like it. I mean, I love it. So at the end of this look, I would just, um, I mean, at the end of this video, I'll put a finished look to this because, yeah, I'd have to film and do some other stuff. So I'll put a picture of the finished look so that you guys see what it ended up like. But for the purpose of this video, we have come to the end. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you liked anything about this video please give it a thumbs up also if you want me to um, um create content on any topic or anything that you would like me to actually do something on or that you want to learn or that you've not seen on this channel please let me know in the comment section i'll be more than glad to actually do this ah, god this is beautiful i mean i can't wait to see the finished look 
<laughs> okay guys thank you so much for watching if you have to subscribe to my channel once again please hit that subscribe button and subscribe to my channel okay hit the like button as well and drop a beautiful comment in the comment section it will go a long way for me believe me it will go a long way for me okay guys i see you in my next video bye guys